In this video, I will compare Sunsama versus Akiflow and tell you which of these scheduling tools may be best for you and your needs. So first, I will tell you what exactly they do and who they are for. Now you will see Akiflow basically helps you control your schedule. Under Akiflow, you can see they integrate with a few different platforms such as Slack, GitHub, Microsoft Teams, Google Meet, Notion, and more. Then you can capture tasks, do time blocking, set up meeting links, you can set up rituals, shortcuts, and you can create projects and folders. Now who it's for? It's for founders and C-level executives, developers, designers, marketers, sales, and for teams. Now in terms of pricing, it is a bit more expensive compared to Sunsama. Now they both have the same pricing structures. You have a yearly plan and a monthly plan, and both include all features, but the yearly plan is of course a bit cheaper, and in this case it's $19 per month, and the monthly plan is $34 per month. So you will save 44% if you pay yearly. Now comparing this to Sunsama, they have a very similar goal, but a little bit different. It's to make work-life balance a reality. In terms of features on Sunsama, you can see they have a guided daily planner. You have a unified daily view. You can set goals every single day and also for weeks. You can do time boxing. And one thing that I think is very cool, it integrates with a bunch of different tools such as GitHub, Monday.com, Asana, and a bunch more. And you can simply drag in tasks from those softwares into your schedule, and then they will be automatically added into your schedule. And the imported tasks do stay in sync as well. Now you can also set up recurring tasks. So for example, every day at 3 p.m. I want to have 20 minutes to answer emails, something like that. Or every morning I want to go to the gym because it's not just for work. It's to get a work and personal life balance. Now it also syncs with your calendar. So that can be Google, Outlook or iCloud. And I really like Sunsama. And in terms of pricing, it is quite a lot cheaper when you pay monthly compared to Akiflow. The yearly subscription is $16 per month that is also cheaper than the yearly plan on Akiflow which is 19 but here the monthly plan is $34 and on Sunsama it's just $20 so that is a pretty significant difference so if you're looking for the most affordable options Sunsama wins especially since they also have a 14-day free trial compared to a 7-day free trial on Akiflow now if you want to claim this 14-day free trial no credit card required you can click on the link down in the description for Sunsama that will take you to this page from there simply click try for free now i have recently also created a full tutorial on how to use sensama it's about 15 minutes long and in that video i explain everything about sensama how you can set up recurring tasks how you can sync to the softwares and your calendar and how it all works so if you're interested in learning sensama go and click on that link in the description as well now to give you a conclusion of sensama versus akiflow here is what i will do for most people, I would go with Sunsama. I prefer Sunsama, I think it's a better software than Akiflow, although Akiflow is also very decent, but I think Sunsama is best. If you work with any of these platforms right here, so you can see Asana, ClickUp, GitHub, Gmail, and all of these other ones, if you work with any of those, and by the way, Zapier integrates with pretty much any software out there. I think they have over seven and a half thousand different integrations. But if you work with any of these integrations, then I would go with Sunsama. And if you don't, I would actually also still go with Sunsama because I prefer it, but some people will prefer Akiflow. If you're looking for a more straightforward tool and basically not really to get a work-life balance but just a straightforward scheduling tool then Akiflow may be best for you but overall I think Sunsama is the winner in this comparison and I would go with Sunsama since it's cheaper and I like the fact that you can set up weekly and daily goals and it will track how much you work every single day and you can really easily move forward tasks I just think Sunsama is best. So that concludes this comparison of Sunsama versus Akiflow. Again if you want to learn everything about Sunsama, go and click on the second link down in the description. That is my Sunsama tutorial. And if you just want to get started with Sunsama, then you can click on the first link down in the description to claim your 14 day free trial without needing to add any payment details. Setting it up will only take a few minutes. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.